I take a trip to my old college campus, go Mustangs. And I started to think about the value of having a chip on your shoulder, especially when I pass by the intramural fields that I spent so many hours working on. I mean, yeah, it was great to make money as an intramural flag football official, but ultimately I was hoping that it was gonna pay off in some way in my career. Now it did, but it took about 10 years to start to see some of the returns on that time spent on the football field. And it brings me back to the question that I used to get a lot. Do I think there should be more women officiating? And do I think there should be more women in sports? Now you have to understand that when I got that question initially, there just either weren't women in the officiating ranks or there weren't a whole lot of women doing sports. Now you can see a huge difference, but my answer is still the same. Only if that's what they want to do because you have to be the one who wants to do the thing. You can't do it to prove somebody else wrong. And trust me, there was a measure of myself trying to prove that I belonged. And at the end of the day, it is hard to succeed. And those 10 years that I spent waiting for it to pay off, that is a long time to be doing something on somebody else's behalf. You have to want to do the thing. That brings me back to leadership. I know that there are things that we all have to do that we don't really want to do, but at the end of the day, if you are doing this to prove something to somebody else, you're not going to get across the finish line. That chip on your shoulder, it might have been great motivation at the beginning, but that's not the thing that is going to help you power through when things are going wrong and when you have to dig deep and find your own source of motivation. There's lots of different types of leadership, including knowing how best to lead yourself. And what I'm going to encourage you to think about are all of the things that you are doing and the reason why, because you will end up being your best self and giving your best effort when you are motivated to do that. There are lots of other leadership tips and lessons specifically related to communication on the website. Go to the blog at talksportytome.com.